Hello, Udemy. I am Shahzad Ahmed from Shiksi.com and uh, welcome in lecture number 36. Today we are going to cover the accordions uh, with example. So you can see we have a sections inside the collapse. You, uh, they are saying the accordions example. Okay, so now you can see you have a lot of coding involved accordions. Okay, so it's totally depend upon you either you are memorizing each and every class each and every sections each and every step or you can just memorize that where is the accordions you always know the accordions and the collapse also are available inside the javascript so you can see we are at the javascript section you can click on the button and you can find where is the collapse oh here is a collapse and here is the cardinals you can just copy this content and you can just paste this content inside your grid system so here is your grid system container row column we are using eight column first of all don't worry, I'm going to explain what's going on and how the accordion accordions working. So go to your page, refresh the page. So now you can see you have by default when you refresh the page, you can see you have by default your first item is opened and uh, these are two are disabled. So this is the activated and this these are the deactivated. Your item one, your item two and your item three. When you click on the second item, you can see it's closing and now it's opening so uh, click it's open it's closed so in this way it works when you click on a particular link so uh, now how it working this is panel group and this is your accordion class and now you can see how it how it's working you have your anchor one item you have your anchor two and your item two and you have you have your third anchor with third icon okay first of all uh, you can roll is button this anchor roll is button because we are not adding the href okay so now data parent i'm saying whenever someone click on this link which id you are going to open first suppose i am saying collapse one so you can see the collapse one id we are going to open so uh, where is the collapse one so you can see this id collapse one is available here whenever you are going to click on this link uh, it can call this ID and you can see it's uh, click on the link it's working click working so in this way you can create your accordionals like this so this is your second ID collapse to and uh, you you can see this is your second ID for suppose uh, you can also delete your content okay remove this you go to your page refresh the page now you have a single element here okay you can uh, remove this these two for suppose i'm going to remove this panel second panel and this is third panel as well remove refresh you have your single panel now how can you create this panel for suppose so separate this with 
okay because this is the panel group so this is the panel group so you, your panels group start here your panel group ends here so you can copy these sections for suppose you can copy these sections and you can paste these sections here now refresh the page both are both are have the same id so that's why both are is now currently open why it's opening because it's you have the in id inside your first one you have in id inside your second one remove this refresh the page so now you can see the first one is open and uh, you can you just need to change the id for suppose i'm saying this id is two for suppose hiding two okay so this is your heading two and uh, i'm saying collapse two so copy this sections and i'm saying also copy this oh sorry not also change this and i'm saying change this as well go to your page refresh the page hit this button you can see now it's working fine so it's totally depend upon you either you are uh, memorizing each and everything or you are just fetching or uh, you are just collecting the concepts uh, that how it how it's working how can you create this and how can you call this so by uh, copying you can see if you need the third item so this is your group make sure this is your group this is your group and now you can call you can copy these sections and you can paste these sections here and you can change the id i'm saying three i'm saying three and now i'm saying this is three and this is also three go to your page refresh the page uh, you can call this it's working fine working fine you have to change uh, this one for suppose this is third and this is third so oh, this is second refresh the page so now you can see it's working fine working fine working fine so it's totally depend upon you uh, which approach you are using uh, if uh, how can you use and uh, they are they have also a lot of documentation available here you can uh, read you can also read this documentations you can call the documentation you can call the collapse by by adding this script inside your jquery script uh, they have the options which options parent toggle and this is a method uh, you can call this method via this and you can use the toggle show hide uh, and you can also use this so uh, you have uh, learned how can you create your accordionals in the next lecture we are going to embed the carousel uh, inside our project so you can easily uh, manage your carousels or you can easily add your carousel using twitter bootstrap so thank you for watching